My dear child, I am here with you closer than your breath, whispering to your heart in this moment of uncertainty and challenge. You have opened yourself to receive guidance, and that is the first step towards clarity and peace. Know that I see your struggles, I understand the burdens you carry, and I am here to support you through every trial. You can also donate us super thanks to support our channel. The path before you may seem steep and difficult, but do not fear, for I am with you. The doubts and fears that cloud your mind are not signs of weakness, but of a heart that longs for something deeper, something true. It is okay to feel lost sometimes, for it is in these moments of uncertainty that I draw you closer to me. I am calling you to look within, to the place where I have placed my spirit, and to trust in the wisdom that resides there. The emotions you are feeling are not to be feared, but embraced, for they are the means through which I speak to you. Do not rush to make decisions out of fear or anxiety, but instead be still and know that I am God. Remember, my beloved, that I have plans for you, plans to prosper you and not to harm you, plans to give you hope and a future. The situation you are facing now is part of that plan, though it may not seem clear to you. I am working in the unseen, weaving together the threads of your life in a way that will bring you into the fullness of who you are meant to be. Amen. The person on your heart, the one for whom you carry deep concern, is also in my hands. Their journey is not yours to control, but to support. I ask you to be patient with them, to show them the same grace and compassion that I have shown you. They are walking their own path of discovery, learning to navigate the emotions that are new and overwhelming to them. Be their anchor, their safe haven, as they find their way. Do not worry about the outcome, for I am the author of your story, and I have already written a beautiful ending. Trust in my timing, trust in my love, and let go of the need to understand everything right now. I will reveal what you need to know when you need to know it. Until then, walk by faith, not by sight. Take heart, my child, for you are not alone. I am your shepherd, leading you beside still waters, restoring your soul. When the waves of life threaten to overwhelm you, I am the rock upon which you stand. You are stronger than you know, for my strength is made perfect in your weakness. So, breathe deeply of my peace. Let go of your fears and rest in my love. The journey ahead is one of growth and transformation, not just for you, but for those you care about. Trust that I am at work in all things, bringing about good for those who love me. You are precious to me and I delight in you. Continue to seek me, continue to trust, and know that I am with you always, even to the end of the age. Amen. Beloved child, I speak to you now with the voice of love, understanding, and eternal compassion. You have come seeking guidance, and I am here to walk with you through the trials you face to bring light where there is darkness, and to offer you the peace that surpasses all understanding. Your heart is heavy with burdens that seem too great to bear, and the path before you appears uncertain. But know this, you are not alone. I am with you, and I will never leave you. I have seen the tears you've cried in secret, the fears that grip your soul, and the questions that haunt your mind. And I say to you now, be still and know that I am God, your refuge and strength, an ever-present help in times of trouble. You may feel lost, as though you are wandering in a wilderness with no clear direction. But remember, even in the wilderness, I am guiding you. Every step you take is known to me, every stumble and fall, and I am here to lift you up, 
to set your feet on solid ground once more. The journey you are on is not in vain. It is part of the divine plan I have for you. A plan to prosper you and not to harm you. To give you hope and a future. The challenges you face are not meant to break you, but to shape you, to refine you like gold in the fire. You are being molded into a vessel of honor prepared for a greater purpose. Trust in this process even when it hurts, even when you do not understand. For I am the potter, and you are the clay. In my hands you are safe, you are loved, and you are becoming something beautiful.